Hello and welcome back to the County of New Bobden. My name is Badger the British and on this episode what we're going to be going on about is the next level of this Liberal University right here. You see we just gone through another little death wave which seems to be happening more and more frequently nowadays. But right now we're going to be dealing with this conundrum because we are now currently waiting. I did make a few little modifications. So all the cars were kind of struggling to get out of the train station here. And they were just all packed in this one area trying to get out to other areas as well. So I put in a dual carriageway lane here with a single lane on the other side. Which as you'll see in a minute just makes it easier for cars to get out. And that is for big game days. Like big game days it makes it very hard for cars to come in and out. And they're all going to walk just to really annoy this recording. Uh, yeah, so that's what we've done there, and uh, I added a historical police station, because it fits in, and we did that in the other one in the live stream, everything else is still the same as it was, so now we just got to come over to this campus area, we can see we've hit the academic achievements, we've hit the amount of students, and we've hit the campus attractiveness way above, um, so yeah, we're just literally waiting for this bar to fill up. So we'll be back once that's done. Okay, so just to make sure we hit the higher level here and everything seems to be good, we're in good stead to meet the criteria for the next jump. So what we're going to do is bring in a bus. There's going to be the campus bus and the express bus. Campus bus at the moment stops at the gymnasiums, comes around here. For the drama school as well. Yeah, let's have it stop at the drama school. Picks people up at the dorms and returns home. Oh. oh no, we'd probably want it stopping there then. So it's got the drama school and the everything in its path. And then have it stop just outside the cafeteria. And it's going to turn back. There we go. Campus bus. Yes, that one. And school bus. And their college. Let's have a look. So you know what? You should pick people up from the station as well. Why not? Drag that one down here. Boom. Very impressive. Yes, maybe instead of it stopping outside the very front of the school, it can stop just, just beside on the double wides. There we go. Good. We're going to do that. And also, what we're going to do is we're now going to start importing going to start doing express lines for students to bring them to campus. No, actually, yeah, let's have this one back there. So this is this is the school direct bus. That's the direct school bus, so it shouldn't be really treated any differently. So now let's bring in some express lines. It's going to come over, it's going to like drop off people, pick people up. Now we need to find a hub. We've got a train that goes from there. Wonderful, don't have to do anything. We could do it from the Badger Hub. So therefore the universities are exchanging students. Or we could go all the way to this one, to this port here. So it can transport people all the way from the other side of the map to here. So let's do that. So it goes all the way to Brooklyn, picks people up. In fact, not Brooklyn Port, not the port. We want, yeah, this hub. Can we have a hub in here? Can we? Oh, we've got one. Good, good. Okay, so the middle of Brooklyn transport hub, and we're going to come back and connect that up. There we go. Bus line, and we're going to change that to a school, and we're going to go Brooklyn uh, to Lib College. Boom. And we're going to see if that's a good line or not. Hmm. We need to have a look at some of these, see if some of these are still profitable. I mean, there's up oh, the Lib College one, that's cool. But yeah, how long have we got? So I'm going to add in a bunch more of those. So we've got that until it fills up to there. Sorry, there's nothing I can do about that. So let's pause and come back to it. So we did it, we hit the academic works, we've done the student stuff, we've done all of it. The cap our campus attractiveness is all, all good. And now we need to work on making this an even better 
campus for the students. So we've got environmental studies, liberal arts library, an art club, liberal art commons, com commencement office. I think that's where they all graduate. Uh, liberal arts academic statue, wonderful, boom. And boom, these are quite hard to achieve. Let's see if we can do it though. <laughs> Let's see. Let's put these down. <gasps> this is going to be big, isn't it? Yeah, it's big. I might move the gymnasium. I'm not sure. <sighs> I mean, it's definitely got its place. But is it at the very back where lots of people on game days try to get to? Or shall we make its own special runoff? just at the back here so that if people are coming from out of state and out of thing they can just slip on to this bit and this road and therefore it's not going to disturb all the lectures and everything oh it fits oh it fits it fits boom oh no what we should have there actually is the uh, commencement thing so it's kind of in the shadows of their high school grounds here commencement that's the one the commencement ceremony and have that in the grounds of this wonderful place right there there we go now we need to bulk and buff this place up let's have a statue dedicated to our awesome football team our awesome run field and track teams Either side for that parallel awesomeness. And an art club. Where can we sneak an art club? I think we should sneak the art club. Somewhere where they're quite out the way, you know? Somewhere where they can feel a bit fancy and above everyone else. Oops. Oh, there's nothing over there anyway. Curve tool. Boom. Art club can sneak onto this campus here. In fact, why don't we put the pathway in first? That might help. What's this? Oh, the li arts library. Well, we definitely got to put that at the back too. There we go. I just hate it when you can't. There we go. Ah, oh, there we go. After a bit of hassle, it's all almost done. Perfect. Boom, 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 boom. I feel like this should be tucked up a little bit more there. There we go. Give them some kind of courtyard or something. That these guys can paint. There we go. It's the fancy bit of the university. But it's a load of art students, so they're a bit trouncy of the grounds. Ooh. There we go. Lovely. So there we go, we've laid it out, we have our campus area. I feel like maybe another, I mean, if you come to a private school like this, you kind of want another activity, aren't you? Really, uh, aqua center. Oh, definitely an aqua center. That's what these people kind of would fully enjoy. There we go, we can have that back onto that as well. Oh no, wait, might have the same issue. Yeah, let's move you away just one second. Because there's always a high density of traffic on game days. I'm very much aware that we want to keep that traffic to a minimum. There we go. If we have it there, it looks like it's been perfectly made to measure in. 
definitely have to have some kind of car park for these. Oof. There we go. Now that looks kind of much more professional. Lovely stuff. So you can come to the games and go straight there. Don't have to interfere with what's going on with campus. It's all good. So let's see what that did to our scores on the doors, shall we? Campus attractiveness, perfect. And our capacity of students is, oh dear, kind of down at the moment. And we need more people, but it is slowly rising, especially with our renowned increasing academic works. Let's get, yeah, let's do some more let's do music. Let's give them that for music. And yes, we will be back once. All is set. We're just going to let this pile up a little bit more. Maybe we could bring a subway station in. What's the chance? <gasps> we can. Look, we can bring a subway station. What line can we bring? Oh, my God. We can bring people from the city. From the city. We can bring them in very easily. Why have we not done that already quite very quickly? Let's go over here. Oh, that'd be great if we could just make it appear right there. Actually, no, right here, just so it's on the edge for game days. There we go. Now we just need to connect her in. My thinking is the more accessible I can make this, this campus, the better it will be in the long run. Is it working? Is it plumbed in? Oh, there's a horde of people going all the way to the athletics. Is there any other easy metro lines we could bring in? Oh, we could start to bring in this one because this one should come across. And that way we get the district line as well coming across. Oh, this nice circular thing. Yes, let's do that. Let's see if we can bring them in as well. How are we going to do that? We're going to go grab another station. It's a nice small one underground. Let's, let's try and keep it. You know what? They can... Go up the shoreline a bit. Well, that's the thing. This is really going to improve people coming. I think we're going to have to give it enough room to be able to turn. And if they could be on the same side of the road so they don't cause a traffic jam, that would also be wonderful. Okay. Let's go plumb this in. And add a new stop to our line. So yeah, we want to come in between that. Let's give ourselves lots of room. Boom. Ah, oh, that went in super smoothly. Pause time here. Just bring it, drag it, and drop it there, please. And also go boom, boom. Now, all these people can come straight over to here. So that should be a solid win for us. I don't think we really need to do too much more than that. We've got them into the campus zone. They're going to get off. They're going to walk all the way over there. Hopefully that's the idea. Will anyone use it? Who knows? College emissions have gone up since we've done the making of this. So we'll be back once this has ticked over. So hello and welcome back. We have done it. We've gone up to acclaimed level, which is wonderful. It also helps when you get to the, near the end of the year, if you just turn on all the policies, which will be turning off some of them just to, you know, be more efficient in our spending because we need to get that tuition fee. As you can see, with one of the policies, it cancels the tuition fee and because heavy expense. But now we can bring in the tuition fee back and also give another policy because it looks like we need more academic works, which is wonderful. And 
yeah, we're going to build this and then we're going to end the rest of the video. So what did we get here in this one? Lots more students, lots of everything, claim renowned, uh, exchange bonus, wonderful. Dun, 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 dun. And we've got a liberal arts auditorium and we've got a liberal arts bookstore and a liberal art laboratories. Sponsorship deals, nice. Okay, let's get a crack a lacking. So what are we putting down? Putting down the bookstore. I think that should be more mainstream to campus. The auditorium should definitely be at the back ish here. Yeah, some nice lovely space. Boom. Laboratories, I don't know what they're particularly working on. But yes, we can squeeze that right next to you. Maybe leave room for a path. There we go. And the bookstore, I feel that should be more of a main campus area. Like, ooh, how close can we get it? Oh, we could put those back to back. No, it's meant to be leafy and a greeny type area, so we should maybe give it a little bit of space. There we go, perfect. I feel we should update it with another dorm room. Just update this little campus with another extra dorm room. There we go, because I feel these might be getting a bit full. No, they're not. They're not even full. Okay, that was a bit of a waste, but there we go. Have we completed attractiveness? No. Oh dear. Oh dear, dear. that's a big, big jump, isn't it? What if we wipe those two back on, just for a sec? Oh, almost. Hmm. Is there something missing? Yep, there we go. Get some symmetry happening, which is good over there. I think there'll be more than one library on campus. There's a lot of books in the world, isn't there? Really. There you go. You've got the two libraries. Junks are supposed. Oh, almost. Okay, right. Boom, boom, boom. What if we put another groundskeepers in? At the very back. Like, just, just very hidden away. Like you wouldn't even notice it if it was there. Okay, turn on the policies. I feel like there would be more art clubs dotted around the place. It's like here, there, maybe a little one at the back here. All right, perfect. So that is enough campus attractiveness to get us through to the next level. The students will gradually increase as our things come over. So yeah, that's why uh, I'm gonna leave that one there. Go into summary mode. So yes, we've expanded our little campus here. I'm going to keep it, just try and keep it in these borders. And maybe when we come to expand with the next expansion, we'll come over here and have like a clear kind of boundary between these two areas. We have brought over a metro from both sides, one going down that way and one that connects the main city straight across. This, gra this greatly improved not only the amount of people going to the games, but it also increased our students that come to the campus and yeah it's starting to look really really nice so i'm gonna leave it there and on the next one we'll finish it off see you later bye bye ciao, ciao. have a great day i hope you enjoyed that and remember to like subscribe and maybe even hit that bell notification button so you don't miss out on the next episode oh, we still got some seconds why not give me some feedback in the comments below? It would be greatly appreciated. And bonus, you can find me on your favourite social media platform. Links are in the description below. Until next time, have a lovely day.